Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Easy Now, and you guys are awesome. In this video I wanted to talk about a strategy on how to beat Val Aron, I think that's how you pronounce it, who is the second boss in this week's challenge of the Elders. He is a Cabal big Centaurion dude and he has shields. Now we've seen him before I believe and his shield changes every now and again. So you need to look in the bottom left hand corner to see what his shield is changing to. Obviously whatever his shield changes to, that's the damage you need to do to him to take down his shields and do damage. But... There's a twist this time because it's challenge of the elders he is joined by none other than the scion flayers yes the scion flayers that we know from the strikes so the new strategy is the same as the old one kind of the boss will be vulnerable at the start so you want to put as much damage to him as possible while getting those grenade kills for your score now this is where the scion flayers come in each of them have their own shield color there's the solar the void and the arc flayer and the boss will draw his power from one of them. The Scion Flayers are immune to everything apart from the one that the boss has taken the shield from. So if the boss pops up saying he has taken the power from the Solar Flayer, the Solar Flayer becomes vulnerable. The other two Flayers are immune to everything. You cannot do damage to them. You need to track down that Solar Flayer kill him as quick as possible and when you kill him the boss becomes immune for a short amount of time so you want to put all the damage onto the boss after you have killed whichever flayer he has taken the power from after a short amount of time he will pull another flayer's power the remaining two once he does that let's say for argument's sake it's the void one you need to track down the void flayer kill him and then he will become immune again i believe with enough firepower you can kill him within two flayers but if you don't, he will draw the power from the last one, which in this scenario would be the Ark. You kill the Ark Flayer and then kill him. I wouldn't worry too much about the grenade score if you have a Warlock with scatter grenades because the last round is just incredible for, vo for Void Walkers with scatter grenades and nothing manacles. But you know, this is tactics on how to beat the boss, not how to beat the challenge mode score target. This boss is actually quite challenging once you first walk in and don't know what you're doing the only way you can really tell which of the flayers are which is the color of their hooded you know their cloaks that they are wearing you can sort of see a um, shield around them but with so much going on around you it's really confusing i found it easier just to look at what color the actual cloaks were so i hope this helped you guys understand this boss fight and get through it i have been easy now and you guys have been awesome. And what would be awesome is if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. And of course, that like button. You help me out so much with your support. I love you all. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah.